is Avery, and I am a first-generation Filipino-American. I never really received any formal sexual education, either from my parents or from my school that I attended. And I think this is primarily because, one, I grew up in a very conservative, rural community, and second, my parents, and especially my mom, raised me to believe that sex before marriage was a sin and to become pregnant out of wedlock was even worse. She often threatened to disown me and made examples out of my cousins and my childhood friends who did become pregnant before they were 19. I think my mom raised me to think this way because she really just wanted me to focus all of my intention and energy into my studies because she grew up in the Philippines and what she really wanted to do was go to college and graduate from college and she never had the opportunity to do that. I really wish I had received formal sexual education because I learned a lot about what I know about my body and sex from Googling and reading Reddit threads, which of course are not valid sources. I also wished I could have gone to my mom with the questions I had. However, I was afraid of what she would say and what she would do. So I felt very alone in the process of understanding my body, how it worked, and uh, sex as well. And this is where my project comes in. My project seeks to first educate and second, increase accessibility to medically accurate sexual education. This is going to be the very first peer constructed and peer led comprehensive sexual education program for women of color. And while this project is specifically tailored for women of color, it's going to be all inclusive, regardless of your gender, your race, your sexual orientation. The final product will be a 10 episode web series that is accessible anywhere at any time. The main goal of this project is to equalize access to information about sexual education and health. My name is Avery and this is Sex in Color.